Okay. Alright, cool. Uh, what? Oh, never mind, never mind. I'm an idiot. Alright, so let's see what we got here. We got Mr. Mahadis. Mr. Mahadis? Is that what we're gonna say? I'm just gonna say Mr. Mahadis. You got him on the cloud. You got Wombat here on the Meta Knight. Interesting. I, I would. I'm a little confused as to why he did not pick Mario in this match, but I guess at the same time, Mario does struggle against the the larger sword characters such as Cloud and, you know, DLC having that innate advantage for 599, but. Right over here, we have Wombat coming back in. He was going for a real cheeky, uh, you know, he was going for a real cheeky jab reset setup right there with the back throw. He wanted to drag him down and probably do the turn around down tilt. But... Alright, so we got ladder combos. And Meta Knight's taking a look at him saying, I got ladder combos too for you. <laughs> oh, it looks like Wombat's got pretty good control. Alright, never mind. He lost it. It's oh that's a high recover. Oh man, that was a that was a fluff punish. But you know what? Right now, end lag. Oh, wow, the wind wow, box taking wind it box. out. If it wasn't gonna be the finishing touch, it'd be the after win box. Ooh, I think he wanted to drag him down a little bit farther, but did not get the fastball on that one. Still hit the back end though. Don't want to steal it too hard. That's definitely a kill option for Meta Knight. Oh, take oh him man, out with the cross slash. Oh, never mind. Yeah, we got we have Mr. Mahadas right now going in. He's giving it all that he's got right now. He's not holding anything back hole, we can tell. Shuttle loop not gonna quite do it just yet. Battlefield coming into play. Ooh! Vanish though on the other hand, or at least I think it's called Vanish. I'm not 100 percent sure. We got him planking it out, waiting out the invincibility. But now innately, Wombat just transferred over stage control right over to Mr. Mahadis. Oh, are we seeing a punish? Yep. So you gotta be very careful throwing that in the neutral. It's gonna get punished just like that. But we got the taunt. He's really feeling himself over here. Seems like it. That's it. Yeah, I'll take control of the answers. I'll take control of the transitions. Sure. While you control the scoreboard. Ooh, Lilac Cruise. Interesting pick. Now, I'm not sure if I really agree with this pick right now because this is Cloud's, arguably Cloud's best stage. He's got, he's got the short hops. He can, he can literally just, he can literally just hit through and shark up airs through all the platforms. He can shark nares. I'm pretty sure up smash even reaches. Up tilt definitely reaches at certain points of it. So I'm not too sure if I agree with this stage pick coming from Wombat, but you know what? Maybe he's got something on us that we don't know. Maybe he's hoping that the tilt is going to mess up, uh, it's going to mess up Cloud's auto cancel. Ooh. Yep, that's the weakness of the Knight recovering well with the shuttle loop. A lot of people try to over respect it and don't want to get caught by it. You can trade there with the first hit of it. Oh, he misses the up air. Or the up shuttle. Yeah, unfortunately missed the shuttle loop out of the combination, but you know what? It doesn't look like he was going to kill. The second shuttle loop that he did land did not kill at that point in time. But we're going to get the limit, the, uh, the limit climb hazard, saving him, getting him out of that situation. But Edgar situation, and Meta Knight brings him back. Him. He had to kill right there. Meta Knight saved him right back. Shuttle loop staling that out. So definitely want to see more coming from Wombat over there. I want to see more of the Nair, more of the drop zone Nair. That's definitely a great way. Just like that. That's going to push him off to the edge. That's going to put him in a bad situation and catch his jumps. And on, off, towards off the stage, Nair, strong hit of it that is, or, uh, or a bear will kill. All right, well, Wombat just barely escaping that up plant punish. Alright, looks like they're playing footsies right now. It looks like that uh, he's taking his time until he... Man, he just really wanted that forward smash right there. Good damn. He was taking his time until that. Alright. Mahadis has got to be careful right now. He's uh, pretty sure he's one dash attack away from possibly an up air into a shuttle loop. Not sure if the up air will confirm at this point, but if he does nothing... Like, yeah, I mean, I haven't seen him air dodge in too many of the up airs at this point. And then he might get caught with something. But just like that, Wombat's also in kill percent as well. Yeah, oh, but he gets the limit cross left. That's gonna do it. That's gonna close out 
game number two here between Wombat Rutherford. and Mr. Mahatis. Now, I'm worried they're gonna see another drastic stage change, or we're gonna see possibly even the Mario come out. I'm wondering how he's feeling right now. I'm wondering what he's thinking right now. But we might see the character switch. And Bowser, Bowser Jr. Jr. Bowser Jr. Yep, he's going with Bowser Jr. I mean, I'm not gonna lie. I've never seen this man pick Bowser Jr., but he was smirking. It's a bold pick, Cotton. <laughs> Thank you for that. He was, he was smirking, though, when uh, when he picked that Bowser Jr. Maybe he's got some uh, some uh, cheeky punish to, uh, all set up in his brain right now. Alright, alright, we're seeing some Bowser Jr. combos right here. We're seeing him take immediate control of the stage. Now what I want to see is I want to see some heavy air guard coming out from this Bowser Jr. Cloud's going to dominate the neutral in this kind of a situation, but you know what? Off stage... If Cloud tries to come back with a hitbox, Cloud's going to just trade that hitbox, so it looks like the Cloud's got some hitboxes of his own right now. Not quite doing it just yet for Wombat, though. Wombat lives to see another day. Oh, man. You gonna see it? Nope. Bear's not doing it. Bowser's getting just a little bit heavier than thought of. Recovery coming from Wombat right there. Very safe, and we get the cart confirmed. Not quite over yet. All right, got the Mecha Koopa. Tech. Oh, almost got the, the cheeky spike. Yeah. Right oh man, he's fishing right now. He wants that cart up there. Ooh, oh, popping out of that limit cross. Like, it's very unfortunate coming in for uh for Mr. Mahadis. Oh, but that's gonna, that has a lot of like that's gonna see a hefty punish. Well, not hefty in this case, but, you know, 173, I think, just sneezing on the Wombat right now is gonna kill him just like the down tilt. Ooh. Oh, back, and he takes his stock. We're yeah. Not, like, even game. You know, I'm not too sure about this matchup myself. This one just seems a little bit on the left field for me, but you know what? Rijo, who recently was in Super Smash Con, Japanese, who was in fact a Japanese Bowser Jr. main, he was he was taking some names. I watched the man personally reverse 3 0 Silver Unknown in a money match with Bowser Jr. only. That was something to see. Alright, getting some shield pressure onto Cloud right now. Now he's got to make something with it. Oh, oh, man, going for that finishing touch. That was, not going to lie, that was a little on the right side there. He was going for one hell of a call out. So no limit on deck on Cloud. So now there's no threat of a limit cross clash right now. He's got to take some time. He's got to charge that limit up. Or he's just got to get abused for a little bit. You know, it all works. He could also be the abuser. Hey, man, it all works. We got that limit almost halfway in already. Cloud sitting at a comfortable 99%. We ain't tumbling yet, buddy. All right, he's got to be careful. He's got limit on deck now. Oh, Ooh. and that takes it. Man, that wombat feeling himself right there, popping off a little bit right now, right after winning the game for Bowser Jr. That is definitely an obscure matchup. I wouldn't say that he was completely in control of that, but. It looks like that he's definitely bringing his he's bringing himself back. Yeah, he's he definitely was able by. to get himself out of disadvantage a lot more effectively. Yeah. Bowser Jr. definitely scraping by for Wombat. All right. So we got the town of city pick now. Cool. We're dying much earlier. Game one we died much later. Game two we died much earlier. But this is gonna this is the issue for him now. Cloud can just kind of camp around, jump from platform to platform to gain the limit. A lot more open space than uh, that Mahatma is going to be able to work with. It looks like Wombat coming in with the Dare Chains. Coming in with the cards. It looks like Mahatma is having a tough time dealing with those cards. Yeah, he's not respecting it at all. You gotta be careful here. You gotta respect. Ooh, oh, good damage ooh, ooh. there. Well, Mahatma's got to respect the card, definitely, especially since anything below 8% will, in the, uh, that hits below Bowser Jr.'s head itself, will be super armored. Alright, 
it. Now Wombat's gotta be careful over here. He's trying to follow up with things that are just aren't true and he's getting punished for it each time. He's running with the cart way too often. It's as, as much as that it's a threatening option, it's also very unsafe when caught with aerials. And Cloud having a nice arsenal of aerials behind him. It's gonna be a little bit on the difficult side. But we got him coming in again. Mecha Cooper also doing some damage, getting some confirms out. Oh man, he really likes those wind box finishes. Oh, we can see. Ah, oh. I thought we were gonna see Ledge grab punish right there. Down smash would have definitely cleared out that stock. But down air will clear out that stock. Good di coming up from Wombat, but the up air not gonna be able to di that. Yeah, walking into that forward smash again and taunting. He's really feeling himself. Yeah, he's trying to get in his head right now. Wombat just throwing out all the right options right now until he gets shield grabbed into cross fire. Definitely giving Mohadas a much more difficult time. But he's landing a little too much with aerials right now. Mohadas is catching on to that, that double dash attack punish. Should make Wombat worry about his options that he's been choosing. Oh, Ooh, just narrowly escaped getting hit with that cross flash. Yeah, perfectly spaced that. There, there it comes in. Bowser Jr., you hit him from below, he can tank some damage. Yeesh. Getting pretty close to getting to a kill percent there. Yeah, Wombat's got to be careful. He is on his winner stock right now, and it looks like F Smash is going to close out game four. So Mr. Mohad is taking that out with a rather convincing 3-1. He did some very good adaptations against his, uh, against the Wombat's initial choice of Meta Knight. Just could not get in.